General Dan Allen is a combat veteran of both Iraq and Afghanistan. He's a West Point graduate, an infantry officer. He commanded the 1st Cav Division, the 18th Airborne Corps, Army Forces Command. He says he'll take all of those experiences with him to the Pentagon when he moves into his new job as the Army's second in command. Well, I think first and foremost, you never forget where you have come from. And uh, I've been blessed to serve with uh, great leaders, uh, great organizations, uh, in a great army that enables uh, its soldiers to achieve their full potential, an environment of trust uh, that is based on dignity and respect. And uh, that environment is, is one that uh, you try to create everywhere that you serve. And uh, having uh, been up to the, the army staff on a uh, fairly routine basis uh, in my current position, the talent that we have across our, our army staff uh, both in the secretariat as well as uh, within the uniformed uh, staff it is just extraordinary. And so uh, that um, uh, leveraging the power of that organizational capacity uh, and creating an environment where they can fulfill their potential is clearly uh, one of the tasks that, that, uh, that I will uh, share along with the chief and the secretary and the undersecretary of the Army. General Allen transferred command and control of Army Forces Command to General Mark Milley before moving to the Pentagon and taking on the job of Army Vice Chief of Staff.